Hello, my name is Ed Ross, and you can find more information about me at edross.co.uk or twitter.com slash edaross for my Twitter account. So, uh, this is the first of a series of vlog posts. I used to do these, and uh, this is another one inspired and as part of the Walker Studios Challenge, and you can uh, Google for that. Nothing much has happened this week that I can talk about so far, uh, because it's just Monday. So instead, I'd like to talk to you about a charity that I'm on the committee for, and that is Hands of Love, and they're at handsoflove.org.uk. I actually uh, became involved with this charity because they asked me to make a new website for them, which you can see there now. And uh, this charity works with a very poor place in Uganda, where even the poor people of Uganda say this place is poor, so it's pretty poor. And there's an orphanage there that they support. And what they do is get good people like yourselves to commit their a monthly amount of money to send to a particular orphan orphan in the orphanage. So when you spon when you sponsor a child, you're sponsoring a particular child, and uh, that money goes to their education and their welfare. And I really encourage you to take a look at handsoflove.org.uk and see if you'd like to take that commitment. I know for a lot of us at the moment it's maybe quite hard to consider giving some money to something monthly or that, like that, but um, no pressure. If you'd want to, then I'd uh, really encourage you to do so. And so just uh, go and take a look. look. Take a look at the sponsorship page and uh, fill in the form, and our secretary will get back in touch with you about uh, starting a monthly donation for the charity. That's handsoflove.org.uk. And I'll uh, see you again, or you'll see me again, on another one of these videos at some point soon. There will be something I can talk about, um, hopefully by next week, because I'm moving house on Friday, which is why you can see maybe a bit of a sellotape there, and the cupboard behind me is looking quite bare. It's because we've packed pretty much everything up by now. So, uh, bye for now.